Okay. Hey guys, it's Alton Jones here with Rehabs to Riches, and thanks for coming to our site to see our, our program. Uh, if you like this video, please go to the bottom and like it, and then share it with others as it, uh, we want to make sure we give you some value. And uh, there's going to be some opportunities for you to be able to sign up for some of our stuff later on as well. Um, this video today is going to be about deal structuring and how do you get deals that you want to rehab, and how do you get the money, and where do you get the money from, and how do you make that work? Well, there's a couple of ways that you can do deal structuring, meaning that you found a deal, you really want to make this thing work, um, and whoever you targeted uh, for, for, the, for the seller, it's either going to be a house that's free and clear, or they have a note on it, doesn't really matter. You want the deal, it sounds good, you put it together. So there's a couple of ways you can do it, either through cash or uh, owner finance, and or taking over your debt subject too. Now there's another way called lease option, but I'm not going to talk about lease options today. That's going to be on another course. I definitely want you to tune into later on as well. Now, here's the deal. When I'm going out finding a house and uh, it's a great deal, uh, yes, I can use cash, but why would I want to use cash if they're willing to give it to me on terms? Hmm. Now, terms. So what I mean by that is the seller is willing to give you their house and the title for absolutely nothing but your word and a note that you can create out of thin air to be able to take control of that property so that you can do your rehab. So now let me ask you a question. Is it better to get the deal with no money or you have to go out and get all the money and structure that deal? Hmm. Think about that. So now, here's a good way of doing it. Number one, no matter if you're going to buy it cash or if you're going to buy it on terms, you need to know your numbers, folks. The numbers are this. Mayo ARV. What does that mean? Your mayo is your after repair. I'm sorry, correction. Your mayo is your maximum allowable offer. Your ARV is your after repair value. So the after repair value is what you can sell it for so you can realize your gain and make that money. But your mayo is your maximum allowable offer. That is the only way you're going to make your money is because when you know what you can buy it at, you'll know what you'll be able to sell it at and anything in the middle is all you. So now, here's the deal. You can get cash and go out and buy a deal, say $200,000 house, and you can pay $200,000. That means you got to go out and get a private money, got to get a private loan, you got to pay a high interest rate or maybe an okay interest rate. But at the end of the day, you got to go do the acquisition, it means you got to get that money to go buy the house and then you got to go raise money to go fix it up. So now, if you have to go do all that, that means you got to go get a $200,000 loan, go get a $50,000 loan. That's $250,000 that you got to pay points and interest on, and then you're going to make a profit after you sell it. Hmm. Well, wouldn't it be even better that if you can get it on terms where you can get a deal where you can structure a no interest, no payment loan from the seller, right? $200,000. They can finance the whole thing. And then you go get you a $50,000 loan from a private lender maybe 8% paid off in six months. So when you go sell that house, if you put 50,000 into it, you pay off as 250, you sell it for 350, there's a $100,000 profit there, folks. That's why you come to me, because everybody wants to make 100 grand on every deal. Wouldn't you like to do that? What would that feel like to make $100,000 on every deal? Well, stay tuned for our next lesson that we're gonna talk about. Go to the page down and subscribe to our, our program so that you can get on our list to get more of this valuable information. So I'm Alton Jones, Rehabs and Riches, and we'll see you at the top soon.